Hello friends, welcome back to Genius Games. I have already started the video series for Maths Olympiad preparation for 2025-2026 for class 4. I have already uploaded practice set 1 and part 1 of practice set 2. Link for this video you will get in the description box. So, uh, in this video I will going to discuss logical reasoning and achiever section questions. So friends, if you want to get more videos like this, please subscribe my channel and press the bell button to get notification of the upcoming videos. You can also like and comment on the videos. So let's start with the questions. So in the section B, we will discuss about the logical reasoning and aptitude questions. These are the five questions on it. So see what are the questions. Find the missing part of the letter in this series. So, if you see, if you see A, B, C, this continuing letter. So, here should be D. D, E, F, then what happened? This is G. Okay. And G, H, I, J. So, the missing with the pair of the letter is D, G, J. And that is option D. So, option D is your correct answer. Next one, if butter is coded as A, T, S, S, D, Q in a certain language, what will be the code for honey in that language? So, butter, P, U, T, T, E, R. And that is written as A, T, S, S, D, now, if you see this one, if you see this is one letter behind, this is also one letter behind, this is also one letter behind, this is also one letter behind, this is all one letter, this is also one letter. This actually, this coded language, these coded letters are actually the previous letter of the, uh, of the actual uh, uh, word that is butter. So, in, the, in that way, in the question honey so in that way this is also you uh, um, as the first previous letter you will need to here we need to write the previous letter so h you write you which is g for o it will be n for n it will be m for it will be f and it is x so g n m f x is the coded of the honey so that is one is g n M, sorry, this one not M, uh, D, this is uh, E, this is not F, it will be D. So, G, N, M, D, X. So, G, N, M, D, X is option B is your correct answer. Okay. Pointing to the boy in a photograph, Rinky said, he is the son of my father. How the boy is photograph related to Rinky? The son of my father is her brother. So, option A is your correct answer. In a row, Mina is 159th from either side. How many people are there in a row? So, here, suppose there is a row. There are so many people are there. And here, Mina, here the Mina's position is 159th. From either side, from if you see it is start side, it will end. From start, it will, his, Mina is 159th position. And in it is also Mina is 159. So if Mina is 159, so how many how many people are there just uh, previous of Mina from the start end? This one that is 158. So that's why Mina is 159. Same way from the end side, it is also 158. So, so Mina is 159 from either side. So, how many people are there? How many people are there? 158 plus Mina's position plus 158. So, that will be 370. So, there are 317 people in that row. So, option B is your correct answer. Find the number of triangles in this figure. If you see the triangles, this 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Whole 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So, 16 
triangles are there, so it is more than 50. So option D is your correct answer. Okay. Now let's see the scholar zone or Jachibar section. You can see the scholar zone section that is also the five questions. So let's see the questions. If growing grass in a shaded in the shaded part of the following figure cost 624. So this is shaded part, this cost is 624. How much will it cost to grow grass in the third, fourth, three fourth of the area of the rectangle ABCD? Okay. So we need to find out first what is the per square meter cost. Then we need to find out the whole area, one three, to three fourth of the uh, this rectangle, and then we need to multiply. So let's see this one. This AG suppose you giving a H. So this square, the what is the area of that square? A G A G or A E A G that square is 4 into 4 that is 16 meters square. And how much this 16 meters cost? This 60 meters cost is rupees 620. So 1 meter cost is 1 meter square cost is 624 divided by 16. Let me change the Okay. So four into four that is sixteen meters square. Now sixteen meters square cost is six twenty four. Now what is the cost of one meter square? That is six twenty four. 624 divided by 16 and that will give you 39. If you divide it with 624 divided by 16, you get 39. So 1 meter cost is 39. Okay. Now what is the area of the rectangle A, B, C, D? Rectangle area of rectangle is 12 into 16. 16 meter square and that will give you uh, that is give you 160 plus 12, 192 meter square. Now we need to find out how much is the 3 fourth of this area. The 3 fourth of 192 is that is if we divide it, 4 8 48 and this give you 144 meters. So, 3 fourth area of this uh, rectangle is 144 meter square. Now, 1 meter square cost is rupees 39. Now, 144, then 144 meter square cost is 144 into 30. If you multiply this one, you get 5616. Okay. Rupees five six one rupees. So that is your option C. Okay. So option C is your correct answer. Next one. Length of a rectangle is twice the breadth. So if let's see the rectangle length of a rectangle is L, and it is twice of the breadth. So length is L, and Breadth is bread. Twice of bread means bread is L by two, or you can see B to be equal to L. Okay. Length is L rectangle, and the length is twice of his bread. So to be equal to L. So, L equal to, so B equal to, breadth equal to L by 2. The, the area of the rectangle is 242 centimeter square. Find the perimeter of the rectangle. Now, what is the area of a rectangle? The area of a rectangle is length into breadth. That equal to 242 
centimeter square. Now L into L by 2, that is bread L by 2, that equal to 242 centimeter square. Now L square equal to 2 into 242 centimeter square, that will give you 484 centimeter square. Now what is the value of L? It is the root over of 484 centimeter square. So here the root over of 484, how you, how you need to do the root over? Root over, you need to root over first this one. You need to pair first this one. You need to pair over from the left side, uh, from the right side. So first you pair this one. Uh, it is 2, it will go 2, 2, will 4. Then it will, then here 2 need to be double, that is 4. Now here 4, 4, 4. Now it will come as an 84. So if you add if you 2, 2, then 2 into 2, that is equal to 84. So 22 is your length is 22 centimeter. Now what is the bread? Bread is L by 2, that is 22 by 2, that is 11 centimeters. Now what is the perimeter of this? Perimeter is 2 into L plus B. That is 2 into L is 22, B is 11, that is 33, and that is 66. So, option A is your correct answer. Okay. Okay. 28. In a stadium, there are X plus 42 rows of chairs. Each row has 230 chairs. If the total number of chairs are 27,600 in the stadium, then find the number of rows. Okay. Now, there are number of rows is x plus 42. Every row has 230 chairs and that total chair is 27,600. Okay. So, it is 230x plus, if you need to multiply this, 42 into 230. If you multiply this 42 into 230, you will get 9660 equal to 2760. Or it is 230x equal to 27600 minus 9660. And this will give you 17940. So, or x, then x is equal to 17940 divided by 230, and this will give you 78. To divide 230, 23 this one, you will get 78. So, your x equal to 78. So, how many rows? 78 plus 42. That will give you 0, 5, 1. So, option D is your correct answer. Okay. Next one. Look at the following table. Item of a pen drive is 680. The pen drive is 680. Keyboard is rupees 1200 each, and there is a mouse. We do not know the price. We need to find out the price. Now, here, what is the question? Ruby goes to a shop and purchases five pen drives, six keyboards, and eight mouses. He gives 14,000 to the shopkeeper and get rupees 480 in return. Find the price of one. Now, he purchases five pen drives. Okay, so five pen drive it cost three four. He co he purchased three keyboards, so that cost is six. Now, how many he gives to the uh, he gives to the shopkeeper? That is fourteen thousand. And how many she get return? See, so return from the shopkeeper is four eighty. So the actual cost of this all three items is. It is 2, 
pi b so cost of this three pen drives four keyboards and eight mouses is 13520 now we do not know the price of mouse so we need to find out the pr price of one now the cost of pen drive and pen drive and the uh, keyboard how many of cost of this pen drive 0 0 0 7 7000 so if you minus this 7000 from here then we will get the cost of we will get the cost of eight mouses okay so what is this one this is 6000 so 6520 is the cost of eight mouses eight mouses okay so what is the cost of one mouse that is 6 y 2 0 divided by 8 that will be give you 8 64 1 so price of one mouse is 800 so option c is your correct now last one so circle or uh, circle plus triangle plus a square is rupees is 171 now another condition is that thus this triangle plus a square is 2 which is equivalent to two circles so from here we can write three circles that is 170 because these two equal to two circles so we can replace these two by two circles so you get one so three circles that is equal to 171 so one circle is if you get this is so one circle value is 57 now one circle is equivalent to three triangles so we can write 57 equal to three triangles so what is the value of one triangle that can do 90 now here it is we need to give out one square plus one circle minus one rectangle or one square plus one circle minus one triangle we need to so here we need to find out the value of one square first so what uh, one square first is if you go this equation one rectangle is value is value is 9 plus there is a one square and two circle two circle is one circle is one circle is 57 so two circle is 2 into 57 from here we will we'll get 257 means 114 minus 19 that will give you 90 okay so one square is 95 value one square is 90 now if you put here the value 95 plus 57 minus 90 if you do you will get 133 so option b is your okay so these are the total 10 questions in the part 2 hope you like the video please subscribe my channel for the more videos we will get more videos in the in this in this practice series in the upcoming videos thank you friends thank you for watching i will see you in the next video